Hey there folks, Mike here, and guess what? We have a sweet new tool. It is called Articulate Replay. It is a screencasting tool, and not only is it fun to use, but it is really easy to use. So one of the first questions that has come up is, hey, is there an easy way to brand my replay screencast? Absolutely there is. So let's say you're working for a company and the boss says, hey, I want you to put some branding on your screencast for us. Not a problem. Option number one is to use a lower third. I'm going to select lower third here. And we'll move that so it's right over our playhead so we can see what it looks like on the screen. Now all I have to do for my lower third here is put in some information. Maybe we are called Cool Corp. And maybe this is a screencast on email. So email screencast. Check that out. So we've got some cool information right there already. But now the payoff for the question at hand is logo. I can select a logo. If I've got a logo handy, which I just happen to have, I can open that up and watch this. Check it, look at that. Now we have our logo on the lower third and we have just branded our screencast lickety split super fast. So let's preview that, check it out. It's gonna come. Oh, beautiful, it animates in. And my friends, you have just branded your screencast with a lower third and logo. So that's option number one. Option number two, what I'm gonna do is this. I'm gonna move my timeline a little bit because I'm gonna bring an image in. So what will happen is, let's say that you know that you're going to be doing your screencast at a particular size. Well, hey, bring in a company image. Maybe you've got a PNG file or a JPEG file of some company branding laying about. I just happened to because I kind of created one for the screencast. But I'm going to insert an image, this one right here. It's a title screen. And what I'm going to do, ignore that dude. Don't let anybody on camera. Um, look at that. Check it. You can bring in an image, a high quality image, and it's going to look great right in your timeline. I'm going to take my screen recording and I'm going to bump it up against, and when I do, check that, it creates a nice little fade transition for me. Let's move that out of the way for now and see what this looks like all by itself. I hit play. So we've got our title screen. It's going to fade into, look at that, it's going to fade into our screencast. So two simple ways that you can brand very quickly and very easily your screencast. You can use a lower third with the logo and some other information right here. That's a great way to brand. But also, you can bring in an image. So if you've got a title screen that you want to bring in, easily done, just use the insert image feature. And that's how easy it is to brand your Articulate Replay screencast, my friends. Should you have any questions about using uh, Replay, please join us in the eLearning Heroes community. Stop on by the forums, ask your questions, and we will do our best to help you out. Take care.